Hello everyone and welcome to a new Let's Play. I am Tryon Morning. And I'm Lady Shira. And we're about to begin Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony. I like how it started disappearing right when I was saying the title. Right. Luckily I had memorized it, so. <laughs> the A's I was look like E's screwed. and I was confused. Yeah, kind of. They look a little silly. But that's not important. What's important is this game just came out today. And I have some good news as well. At first I thought I was going to be able to play this whole game, but it turns out we can now. Spike Chunsoft, I guess, changed their minds just recently, like within the last day or so. At first you could only do the first chapter, but now you can play the full game. Yay. So yay. That is very exciting. Uh, obviously we played the first two Danganronpas, well obviously if you've been following the channel. If you haven't, we just played the first two Danganronpas last year, and they were completely blind to us. This game's going to be completely blind since we haven't played it before. I've been keeping myself free of all spoilers. Um, all well. information about the game, except for you, because <laughs> someone had to travel to Japan just earlier this month. Yep. And you happen to see some Danganronpa like action figures and plushies and that kind of thing. Yep. And what else did you do? I bought you one. You bought me one, and it spoiled the game. It's completely spoiled. We know at some point Monokuma is a fish in the game. <laughs> I, I don't know what that <laughs> signifies, but at some point Monokuma is holding a fish, I guess. Spoiled. So that's <laughs> full disclosure. That's how much I know about the game. At some point, Monokuma's gonna have a fish, and yeah. I'm sorry if that's a spoiler for you guys. <laughs> I don't think it's too big of a deal. <laughs> but yeah, I don't really like watch too much promotional footage or any of that kind of thing. So usually, I I'm pretty like completely oblivious on all the details about what this game's gonna involve, except for the fish. Except for the fish. Other than that, yeah, we're gonna be jumping into things. With the new game. I actually played just a little bit to make sure it would record correctly. Which is a good thing because it's the first time I went through this, we weren't recording sound. So yeah, let's begin a new game. No, I don't have anything from the demo. We will want to play in English. Why? Why? Okay, you could translate everything <laughs> for us instead of any Japanese, right? No. You have to read all the lines. Just go to the options real quick, see this. Um, I remember when we played the other two games, we did adjust this a little bit to make the voice a little bit louder. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, spoilers, the voices! Dongan Rampa V3! <laughs> Dongan Rampa V3! Oh, I was oh. gonna say, like, I kinda reminds of Nekomaru, then that, like, high pitched <laughs> part came in at the end. I like having the, the voices up from yeah, the other volumes. I think that's a good because idea. Because otherwise it gets overwhelmed by the music, I feel like. It's a good idea. We can always adjust it later if that's an issue. Ooh, controls shooter or Dangan Rampa? What does that mean? I don't know. I'm not sure what this means exactly. I guess I'll leave it on shooter for now, it's a default, and then I'll change it if I understand what it means later. Or if someone explains it to me, I guess. Oh yeah, I guess I should mention, if you know any spoilers about the game, please don't mention it in the comments. Like I said, um, this is blind for us. Probably a lot of people that are watching this when it first comes out aren't going to know about the game either, so please uh, don't discuss things that happen in the game at later parts out of consideration for those who haven't seen it. All right, let's get things started. Oh, we're, we're not oh yeah, that's right. There's one more. The, uh, the logic and... Hmm, you know, in the other games we played on normal, right? Yes. I'm kind of thinking about switching the mean because they seemed easy enough that's for the most true. part. Okay, but I'm scared. Oh, I don't know about the action, though, because sometimes the mini games can be a bit... Like, they're a bit tricky to learn at first, you know? That's true. Well, you can always switch it later, I think. Maybe there's a reward if you do it on mean. I don't know. Mean. It's basically about you get more rewards, but I assume that just means like the Monokuma coins. Monokuma. Oh, uh, yeah, and by the way, there's something that's gonna happen during this uh, intro sequence, which could be considered a spoiler for the games we didn't play, which was Ultra Spear Girls. And, oh. Well, I guess that's not a game, but the anime, so. Don't think too deeply about anything you may see here. Or I guess we, we could just close our eyes and pretend we didn't see any of this. Should I close my eyes? You can. I kind of saw the intro before already, but I wasn't really paying too much attention. Like well, I said, I played I've a little bit. I've seen this one. This one is good by Yeah, despair. we saw this one. And we saw the first game too, obviously. Yeah, this is like the game we didn't see, so. Don't look. Well, I mean, I already saw the intro, but it was nothing that I really was familiar with because not that I was familiar. I, I didn't really say anything that I didn't recognize because I wasn't paying attention half the time. 
I was kind of uh, experimenting with the settings as well. Story. The is... story's not over yet. Oh. I don't know. Close enough. Where's the fish? A new killing game will begin. Oh, great. The killing's not done yet. Team Danganronpa. I guess they have their own development team just for the game. Makes sense. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing. No light, no sound, no form, no voice, no knowledge of who I am. Who am who I am? <laughs> who am I? I <laughs> know, it's tricky. <laughs> I extend a hand. A hand that belongs to no one. Am I Arya Stark? <laughs> yeah, a girl's no one or wherever it was. To take hold of my existence. I'm glad the whole part of the series is over. Jesus Ugh. Christ. I'm not even going to talk about that. Let's not get into that right now. Oh, it was a girl, I think. Indeed. This is me. Hello, me. My name is Kaede Akamatsu. <laughs> the, I have to go off on a little bit of tension. Remember me? No. From the first Danganronpa? No. Uh, it was when, um, what's his name? Kiyotaka. When he started going crazy. Oh my god, yes. It's me! I do remember now. <laughs> it was like, me, is that your new name? <laughs> eventually did clarify. I remember. I just remembered who I am. Nice to meet me. <laughs> it just reminds me of that. <laughs> I'm the protagonist of this crazy story. We get to be a oh, girl this time. Yes, a female protagonist. You know what that means. Great. It means you're going to be doing most of the reading this time. No. For once in a Danganronpa game. Well, I guess if we did Ultra Despair Girls before this, you would have had to do that too. Because it's supposed to be all With females. With multiple girls. Hence, Ultra Despair Girls. Ultimate Revival. She's the Ultimate Revival? It just says Ultimate Revival. I don't know. Well, I guess she doesn't know what she would be. So we'll just call it Ultimate Revival for now. Makes sense. I stumbled out of the locker in a daze, but as soon as I did... I fell on the floor. I have to say, I like how crisp the text looks on this. Crisp. I think it's maybe because this game was made for like the new generation of consoles. I think the original games are for the PSP, or maybe the PS Vita. But anyway, they were for like a portable console. This game was like made on like PS4 and for PC, so this is like top of the line Danganronpa now we're dealing with, which is pretty cool. Mm. I couldn't even brace for impact as blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. Aww. <laughs> I was gonna say, at first she kind of reminded me a bit of uh, Sonya from the second game, but mm -hmm. now she's starting to strike me as more of a her own character. Like mm -hmm. the first look at, that I got of her, she kind of, I was like, wait, is that Sonya? Like, no, that couldn't be. But thanks to that pain, I went from dazed to annoyed real quick. Huh? Huh? Wait, where am I? What is this place? I rubbed my throbbing forehead. Yep, this is definitely going to leave a bump. <laughs> I looked around. That's this is so awesome. interesting already. Look at this, how we have um, the walls, but they're different from the first game. We have like barbed wire on them and they're bars. Mm -hmm. But it's not like the place- But there's like also plants to. growing in them. Yeah, like this place has been abandoned for a long time and you can see mm -hmm. that on the other parts of the ceiling too. But it's just funny how the windows aren't completely covered. Like you could- Kinda maybe squeeze out, but probably not. Yeah, this is a classroom, all right, but I don't recognize it. Where am I? What am, am I, I doing here? <laughs> also, they have a hell of a speaker system. Yeah. Ah. Is this a dream? I just have to pinch myself, right? Oh, what the heck was that? <laughs> a pinch of the cheek. But that's not what it sounds like when I pinch myself. Well, that's so what it sounds like. So I pinched my cheek, but all that did was make my head hurt in two places instead of one. <laughs> well done. Um. Okay, hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. This place looks overgrown. Like, maybe this is set like years or decades after the first two games. Maybe. 
Because, yeah, why is there plant... Like, it's it looks like it's a different school to me. I'm guessing it is. Yeah. But it's still strange that everything's overgrown. The other schools didn't have, like... like they were very orderly. Screens. They had blackboards. Yeah, that's right. It's, and, like, the blackboard is a screen in this one. True. Mm -hmm. I almost didn't think about that. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end, I just couldn't. Bam! Thank you for reading that. <laughs> Whoa! Suddenly, the locker next to mine started swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noise. Please God, be a boy. Is there another one? Be a guy. As I fearfully turned around, the locker door slowly opened and... Is it Monokuma? I hope not. Okay, it's another... He looks male. ...human, I think. Yes! Unless he turns up his head and he's actually... No, it says a boy. Well, yeah, but we still haven't seen the face officially. Come on. Be a boy. It's a boy. Okay, maybe it is. Yes, you get to read. A normal boy. He's a normal boy. We still haven't seen his <laughs> face. Maybe he's terribly he's disfigured. A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. You haven't heard him speak either. In fact, he might be a high school student too. Next thing you know, he's going to be talking like Nagito. Oh. He looked bewildered, and when he slowly lifted his head... He looks kind of like accusatory at us. Ah! Or, yeah, confused and bewildered. I guess that's the sound he made anyway. That was a funny sound. Um, you know, another thing I'm noticing as I'm kind of looking around the classroom because I've been paying attention to that. I don't actually see any cameras in this one so far. I like the door. Yeah, very nice looking door. It's very, it's obviously a very fancy school. Like I said, the graphics look pretty good in this one so far. Everything's a lot more detailed than like the other games. Mm -hmm. But... Unless those things on the sides are supposed to be cameras, I don't see any cameras. Hmm. Which is really weird considering That's a good point. what tends to happen in Danganronpa games. He screamed as if he'd just seen a monster, fell on his butt, and scooted back. Oh, he just Ugh. sprung up. Whoa. H who are you? Are you with those other guys? Huh? What other guys? The people who kidnapped me. Um. Kidnapped? Wait! Where am I? What are you gonna do to me? Hey! Hey, hold on! Straighten out your hat! Yeah, it doesn't know it's not allowed to wear hats in school. Come on. I firmly gripped his shoulder. It's gonna be against the rules. It's gonna get punished for that. You know? What's your name? Huh? Huh? Uh, um... I'm, oh my goodness, I have to say the name. I was hoping he would say it so I, I could figure out how it's pronounced. Shuichi? Is that what it is? Mm-hmm. Shuichi Saihara. Yeah. Or something close to that. I'm Kaede Akamatsu. Now listen to me, Shuichi. Got it? Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> You're not the only one who's confused right now. Now listen to me. Shut the hell up. Huh? Ah, sorry. After making him shut up, I retraced my steps again. That's right. I was kidnapped too! Ah, now we're starting to remember. Oh, it's the murderer! I was the usual route to school <laughs> when all of a sudden someone shoved me into a car. Why are they naked always? <laughs> it's just the uh, undetailed killer. <laughs> if you saw what their clothes were, maybe you could guess who they were. I shouted for help, but no one came to rescue me. Or maybe all the despair people are actually nudists. That'd be a twist. Oh, God. <laughs> That's like a requirement for being in the <laughs> ultimate despair group. Ugh. Everyone pretended like nothing happened. It made me think how rotten the world is. So it's kind of interesting. And then, I lost consciousness. How in this game, it's similar to the second where we don't really know a lot about ourselves, although now she's starting to remember. So I wonder what direction it's gonna go to. If like, we're just gonna remember everything as it goes along. Obviously like the second game where there's some reason why we can't remember. Hmm. That's right. And when I woke up, I was inside that locker. Huh? Same with me. Were we kidnapped by the same people? Uh, it seems like it. Probably. Unless there's gonna be like some twist like we're one of the bad people and where we've had our memories removed so we could be undercover. Well, that's kind of like, kind of like the second game, but not quite. Jeez. But why me? My family's not rich and I'm no one special. I'm just a normal high school girl. There's no reason to kidnap me. Uh, okay. Me either. I'm just a regular guy. Yeah, we know. You're normal boy. <laughs> normal boy. That'd be funny if they just called him normal boy, I boy wish, until he figured out his name. I wish it was normal Too bad he introduced himself right away. Damn it, Shuichi. And this is a school, right? 
Why did they take us to a school? Because um, we're school children. I wonder why. Do you think they're still gonna have that, like the uh, like the memories are removed from everyone again? I don't know. Or is it gonna be like this where they actually were kidnapped? Hmm. We will find out. Oh, well, yeah, probably. <laughs> it wouldn't be much of a game if they didn't oh, find out. Oh, is this an announcement? Yeah, it is. It's the announcer. You can be the announcer. Oh, it's the same announcer from the other games? Okay, fine. Obviously. You're, you've already got the role. You can't just switch it now. <laughs> He's the only reoccurring oh character. Oh my god, look at how scary Shuichi's right hand is. Oh my god. It looks very, like, shiny and plastic. <laughs> it's so yeah, it's scary. Funny. Anyway, time for a narrator. Hey there. I'm sure you're confused right now. You're thinking, where am I? Or where I am? <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't explain that, but I can give you a basic explanation about the controls. We kind of know this already. I'm assuming it's the same as the other I games. I can't trust him. Less. He lies. Mm, I think it was only the second game where he lied, and I think that was intended. Maybe. Actually, I'm still not sure about that. But it was definitely wrong in some cases. Left stick to explore or move the reticle or whatever. When you have a target in your sights, press the A button to investigate it. Right stick controls your your view of the surroundings. Okay. And smack. RB to smack? Oh, that's kind of new. Can we smack are we normal boy? Are we actually smacking things? I'll have to give that a shot. That's that's kind of new. You might find something amazing. You can always press the LB button to return objects to their original position, so relax. Wait, so it you are moving stuff around and then you can reset. Is there gonna be like puzzles based on that? I don't know. That it could be interesting. The stuff doesn't really look movable, but I guess the stuff is movable. Yeah, it is weird, because it's like um, you know, it's a, a drawing of a room, so you wouldn't think they would move. Like, you know, they're not like sprites, they're right. um, just just like CG or whatever you call it. Press Y button, a mysterious power will activate. What? What? Oh, is that the thing where it tells you where to look? Oh, maybe. Probably. Sorry, it's a lot of information, but if you forget anything, you could press the... What the hell button is that? I guess that's the start button to review the... Con I don't know. It's the Xbox One controller, so that's what it looks like. So I guess it's the start button now. What a crappy controller. Investigate this place thoroughly. That's how you progress the story, you know? All right, so... We'll have our first look around. Oh, okay, I kind of see how the, the desks are now, so I can see smacking them. You think you could? I guess so. Cause they yeah, like... I guess the, I guess again, now that I'm looking around, yeah, they, they move, so... So, yeah, it makes a little beep when you go over things you can move. Of course, uh, let's see, the Y button does that. Oh, it's actually slightly different. You could actually move around when you're in this mode. And the mm. items are highlighted. So, you know what? I don't have to do like the constant making that sound anymore when I'm trying to look for objects. <laughs> <laughs> like it's echolocation like a bat. Now you can just see it. It's a toggle. That's kind of cool. So, what should we start with? We can talk to him. Can, I, I have are to the see. barbed wire a thing that we can invest in? Yeah, I think so, because those were. Oh, you know what? That's right. Like the other games, you can't go to uh, save. I want to see if we could smack him. I'm, I'm kind of nervous about it, though. What's going to happen if I do that? You oh. just tried to smack him in the dick. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> wow. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> I like how it's just a flying hand. Yeah, give him a high five. <laughs> I was hoping he would do something clever. Aw. <laughs> I'm kind of disappointed. The dick is where you start smacking. I went to like his central. High I went to central boy. mat. Like I went to his central location. Um, yeah, okay. Well, Are we'll have you words really a normal boy? Let's smack you. <laughs> we punch. have to check. We've had this issue in the past. <laughs> we have to make sure. <sighs> anyway, let's just stay calm and think. I'm sorry I shouted at you earlier. Also sorry I smacked you in the dick. <laughs> and no. other places. No, it's okay. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Hey. Okay, I thought he was going to be like Kazuichi and be like, but you can smack me all you want. It's okay. Anyway, this place, <laughs> this place is... Weird, yeah, I noticed. You don't think we got caught up in something bad, do you? You think? Almost certainly something, something bad. Something bad. Yeah. What's going on? What have we gotten ourselves into? Random history. Trouble. Oh, it goes back to this mode automatically, okay. So the window, window. and barbed wire are the same thing. Let's take a look at it. The outside of the window is covered in greenery and barbed wire. Why are the school windows covered in barbed wire? Lock us in here. 
I guess we can get out of this mode. We know what to look at. We woke up inside of these lockers. So is everyone gonna be inside a locker? I have to make sure we open every single locker <laughs> in the game just in case. Snake might be in one. <laughs> why were we in these lockers in the first place? I feel like they might have made a Metal Gear reference at one point in these games. Really? They made like a lot of references to different That's things. True. Is this a monitor? Nothing's being displayed right now. Seriously though, what is it? It seems really out of place here. Um, some kind of intense sound system? I wonder if there's like gonna be like noise torture. Oh god. Like you're gonna play loud sounds and try to like. I will I us hope I don't have to hear it in my real ears. Hopefully not, what if it's really loud? Oh that sounds irritating. That's a blackboard, right? I think it's a smart board. Every classroom has one, but this blackboard is also an L C D screen. That's something you don't see every day. I wonder what the point of that's gonna be. We have the monitor above it to see like what I assume are gonna be Monokuma announcements. Huh. Interesting. Maybe we can like write about our clues is on that the a clock. Board. Doesn't really show. I think anything. it's a broken clock. Maybe. What else is there? The door. The door. We're probably not gonna be able to get it out right away, but it's the only thing we'd love to see. I wonder if there's um like collectibles like the Monokuma coins or whatever. I don't see Oh, we were supposed to slap random shit. Slap stuff. Right, that's probably Oh, Ooh, there we go. One. Smack all the desks. <laughs> I wonder if you just watch this and you just like bust everything <laughs> apart. Come on, break apart. There we go. I guess that's all the slapping is for, it's just getting coins. Oh, okay. I mean, it's kind of more amusing this way. Come on. Oh, the aiming doesn't seem to always work. You have to be like very specific. Slap. Well, I'm glad uh, you remind me about that. I probably would have forgotten. Yeah, you just slapped Shuichi and then you're like, <laughs> oh, that's, that's it. I mean, that was going to be the most exciting part if we were able to slap him. I thought there was going to be some dialogue with that, like, what? You slapped me? <laughs> right in the dick. <laughs> I guess that's it, just the desks? Probably. Here, slap the, slap the uh, what do you call it? Barbed wire, yeah, that's Ow, smart. Oh, that sounds painful. I think that's all that's going to really be uh, slappable. All right, so let's let this go out the door. Where am I? Why was I kidnapped? Who kidnapped me? Very fancy door, you're right. I don't understand this at all. Almost like it should be more of like a mansion than a, a school classroom. Yeah. But that doesn't matter. At least for now. I was gonna say, in that window behind it's all fancy. Like to the left. Oh, the red pink window? No, it's to the left. That's above the bookcase. Is that a window or something? Oh, I thought it was a board with like stuff posted on it. Oh, maybe it is. It looks kind of like a window to me. But um, yeah, it might just be a board. Cause I was like, that's a weird place for a window. <laughs> like, is that like a window to the other classroom or something? Hey, let's just get out of here as fast as we can and find some help. Uh, okay. Yeah, good <laughs> idea. Uh, okay. We ran as fast as we could to the classroom door and opened it with all our strength. But then... Oh! Oh, uh, what? Hell yeah! Found you! What? Oh my, this escalated very quickly. What? A, a monster? It's a robot. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Maybe this will just be another student controlling it. I'm hoping. This is bad. We need to get out of here. Uh, okay. Wait, 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 wait! Um. Oh, oh, what is this? Oh. Kaede, over here. How do you say that again? Is that yeah, that's yeah, correct? Okay. I think this is an actual action part of the game. Is it? Oh my oh, god, it is. Shit. Oh my god, there's actual action. I don't know if it's actually chasing us or not. I didn't want to stop to think about it. Oh, oh god. He's right here. Where are we going? Oh, there's another How one. How is he everywhere? There's a bunch of robots. <gasps> Don't go that way. Over here. I, I'm so shy. I was not expecting Shui this at all. He's being sassy and he's making me angry. It's like Otacon. I know. In Metal Gear Solid 2. When Shui you. I trusted you. So, um, yeah, it is like Metal Gear. We have a little uh, Metal Gear chasing us. What are those things? They look kind of like Metal Gears. 
A little. Okay. Come on. Where are you, dude? I just was still running this way. I was not expecting. Yeah, he's chasing us. I can hear him now. Quickly to the gym. Oh, no, not the gym. Nothing good ever happens the in the gym. The gym is always a bad place to go. And we frantically dove toward the door. We saw something we never expected to see. Oh, more people have arrived. Look Whoa. at that one so tiny. Yeah. He looks like a robot. Oh, my God. Who is he? <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm just taking a look at all the, uh, the, the characters we have. The guy's got There's like, Phoenix right us. hair. What, what is going on here? There's like, what, 17 people all together? 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Oh, there's 16 of us then. Yeah, okay. So okay. That, all right. that's pretty typical. Okay. All right, well... Yeah, let's not judge any of them before we I'm talk to them. I'm judging that I, one. I kind of already have like, oh, that's gonna be that he character. Looks like that's he's gonna be that character. He's wearing a mask and he's smoking. We got the uh, the character with the boobs, of course. As I always. thought our character was the character with the boobs. Did you see them? No, I actually wasn't focused on the boobs. When she came out of her locker, no. that was like all I could notice. Oh <laughs> well, now we know who's obsessed. Huh? Did you all get chased by that monster too? Uh, oh yeah. What are they? What do they want with us? Who has that voice? <laughs> I don't know. It's unknown for now. Do you want me to check on what's happening? Is it the little one? You can't! It's too dangerous out there! Akane? It's likely that monster <gasps> still lurks nearby. Oh, God. <laughs> Is that the same voice actor as a what his name? Whatever his name was? Who? The Creeper. The, oh, the chef. it might be. Like, oh, why don't you suck the poison out? <laughs> what? <laughs> when did up. he say that? You don't remember that? No. Oh, man. I only remember that from Ghost I... Adventures. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. There was a point where you said, oh, yeah, I, I'm poisoned to, uh, to Sonya. Okay. It's like in the very beginning of the game. I don't remember. Wait! I can't believe that part's not memorable to you. <laughs> no. <laughs> I shouted at the top of my lungs. Who are you guys? And why am I here? And that makes 16. Yes, I already counted thank you. We got a math expert over here. I'm talking about us. There are 16 of us. Who's speaking? All high now? schoolers. It's the one in the middle? I don't know. What do you think that means? The tiny one. <laughs> I hope he has that. No, I want the tiny, like the deep voice. Yeah, that's true. 16 high schoolers and one robot or multiple robots? A robot's controlled by one person. I don't know if they're going <gasps> to. Maybe this was the guy talking. I don't. I don't want to jump the conclusion, but looking at his face, I don't like him. He looks smug. He does look smug. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Didn't answer your question. My name is Rantaro Mommy. All right. It was this guy. <laughs> That's a terrible Rantaro. name. Rantaro. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sounds like Rantaro. <laughs> Rantaro? Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Of. <laughs> because like it should be like Rantaro, but. Ham ran Taro just sounds like a ham Taro. <laughs> well, let's see who did that for now. What? Huh? Um, okay. Yeah, whatever you say. You know. I don't even know what he said because I was distracted by ham <laughs> Taro. <laughs> Wait, you could probably find. Is there the uh, the transcript button yet? There. Oh, he said, I'll give you my name. It's that. Let's leave it for now. And I was like, yeah, okay. let's leave it at that for now. Oh, are there eight boys and eight girls? I didn't count. Probably. We'll see in a second. Anyway, why does it matter if there are 16 of us? There might be more coming. I already forgot this guy's voice. Nah, I think this is all of us. This is what I think it is, anyway. How do you know what it is? There's Ooh, always Cam someone Taro. who knows in advance. Like, oh, this is gonna be a, you know, a life-killing event somehow. What? If this is what you think it is? Didn't you see the other Danganronpa games? Hey! <gasps> Wait, I mean, what? <laughs> <laughs> what? You some kind of fucking know-it-all? If you know something, spit it out. So she's like a mixture of Mikan and um. Mikan. Yeah, Mikan. You remember Mikan? Why is she anything like Mikan? Cause boobs busting out. Oh, I thought that was Akane. Oh god, yeah, Akane. I don't know why I mixed the two up. Okay. But yeah, Akane and um, what was I gonna say? Who's the one that cursed all the time? I'm trying to remember her name. Who did curse all the time? I don't remember anyone cursing all the time. Was it the first game? 
I thought it was one of the girls. Oh no, it was only after she like had her personality flip, Celeste. Oh, but she yeah, was kind of yeah. composed until the end. I like so you kind of say like Fuhiko too, but that's a guy. <laughs> that's that is a guy. And also there was Mondo, who was cursing all the time like a sailor. Oh, Mondo. But yeah, Celeste when she had her like, when she went mental. She was like cursing like a, mm. like oh you bitch, fuck you. <laughs> It was at that moment, an unknown voice suddenly echoed throughout the gym. Okie dokie! <gasps> Wait. Is this a new Monokuma voice, or is that the other guy? Are there two? I don't know, I guess we'll I see. Know. I don't know if I should do the Monokuma voice then. Well, let's do, like, whatever he was trying to do. Okay, quiet, everyone. Shame me down, shame me down. <laughs> Wait, Monomi? What? What's that? That's not like a Monomi sigh. Yeah, it did. No, 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 it's Simmer Down. I can hear more of the voice. What? Huh? Who's that? Where are they? Oh. Well. <laughs> Thanks for bearing with us! Oh my. We're gonna get a lot of puns, aren't we? You remember there's like five minutes of bear puns? Are you serious? Damn it! They're more monsters. We're surrounded. I'm so confused ah. by his hair. These aren't monsters. They're exiles. Exosols. Exosols. Yeah. And I'll go with that. That's that. They're highly mobile bipedal weapon platforms, also known as Metal Gears. Yeah, come on. Weapons. Hell yeah! <laughs> Should we take these for a spin by killing one of them? I think they have different voices from each other. Yeah, they do. Interesting. Ah! Wait a minute! We haven't even introduced ourselves to everyone yet. Calm down. It wouldn't be any fun picking on playing good for nothing commoners. Yeah, at least if you're gonna start killing people, wait for us to do all the introductions. <laughs> you're right. We should at least think of an interesting way to kill you. Maybe I'll pick you up and squeeze you till your guts come gushing out like toothpaste. Wait! Please, not like toothpaste! Definitely sounds like an idea Monokuma would have. Oh, I think that was a female uh, one. Oh, I just imagined it. I can't handle gore. Well? That's weird. Yeah, they all have different voices. Then what if we start peeling off their limbs one by one like string cheese? Ah! Please, not like string cheese either. Ah! Wait, we can't kill them with the exosols. According to the schedule, the exosols aren't supposed to show up till later. What are you saying? They sound like some voices from the other games. That voice reminds me of, uh, almost Hajime. Is it? Maybe it is. I don't know. But we're in the exosols, exosols right now. Ah! What an annoying name. <laughs> What'd you say? What an annoying name. Oh, yeah, exosol. it, it trips me up each time. Exosol. I'm like, ugh. Oh, so we are. We screwed up. We're not supposed to be in the Exosols for our first appearance. Yeah, the red one definitely reminds me of Monokuma. This one definitely reminds me of Monomi. This one sounds like Gund- uh, not Gund- um... I'm always mixing up the names now. Uh, what's his name? The gym but it, guy. But it doesn't really sound like him. It sounds a bit like him. A little bit. Uh, what's his name though? I forgot already. Nekomaru. Nekomaru, that's what it was. What are you saying? Oh, I told you you should write the script. That does sound like Hajime though. No, you didn't. Well, why don't we just get out of these mechs? It shouldn't be too late for that. Okay. Maybe it's not like Monokuma. I don't know. They all just been saying like one word though each time. Yeah, let's see that. So. Okay, ready. I guess we'll see what they look like soon enough. They're all bears. Oh, they're all little Monokumas. Monotaro. Monosuke. Mono. Monophony? Monophony? Monodom? Monokid. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god. It's like- They're the Power Rangers. Oh. What? Or something else? I was gonna say it's like Bowser and his little Koopalings. <laughs> oh, okay. Because they're mono cubs. Oh look, one of them has a guitar. What do the others have? It's... I can't see from so far away. Yeah, we should have even closer to this. Huh? I think one of them's wearing a scarf. Hey. What? 
What? What is this song? Right now, you're on the threshold of an amazing adventure. <laughs> <laughs> I have to just listen to this for a second. Hold on, guys. Go on. One. One. Two. Two. <laughs> this is so interesting. One. Oh, okay, back to one. Uh, two. <laughs> <laughs> is all that remains of okay, now it's repeating. Oh, I think, unless there's more. Anyway, C. Right now, We're out at the Exostals. <laughs> Voice is so distracting. I know, it's distracting each time. <laughs> now we're not scary anymore, right? 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 His desperation is strangely terrifying. I'm probably just gonna do the same Monokuma voice for these until I figure out each one and what would sound good. You guys ready? Well, that one's Kiss. So. Yeah. Okay. Well, this one's easy because it's kind of like Gun. Uh. God, why do I keep wanting to say Gundam? Nekomaru. Right now. Punk ass is better. Brace yourselves. Ah! And he's just outright terrifying. That's right. I'm a messenger from hell. From what? See, this is kind of like Gundam as well. It's almost like a mixture of the other characters. I'm a messenger from hell, from the depths of hell. Here to drag it down to hell. To hell. Hey. His glasses. No, no, Mino Kid. You're saying hell too much. It's ruining the hellish impact. Hey. Eh, what's hellish mean? What? Hey, what's up with these stuffed animals? How are they moving? I have no idea. Hey, moving stuffed animals. Yeah. He does oh! have a deep voice. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, I got my wish. On top of that, it seems like they're calling themselves the Mono Cups. <laughs> this is great. Moving stuffed animals? Mono Cubs? Huh? Wait, you guys call yourselves the Mono Cubs? Ooh, what's this one? A robot. He didn't say anything though. Oh, he's in talk maybe. No, don't bother asking Mono Dam. Like Gundam? I guess so. Mono -dum. He only talks to close friends. The years of abuse have really done a number on his heart. Isn't that right, Mono Dam? Yeah. Mono Dam! You won't even open your heart to me! <laughs> Rantaro. Looks like I was right. Actually, his eyes remind me of Fuyu. He goes round eyes. This is exactly what I thought it was. But who's behind all this? Why the ridiculous theatrics? Shut up! Gah, yeah, shut up! You, all of you are reacting way too normally to this. It's boring. Hmm. Actually, don't their clothes seem kind of boring too? Hey. Wait a minute. You think maybe they haven't been given their first memory yet? Uh, here we go. What were we gonna say? He has an abacus, I said. Ah, okay. That's what he's got. Yeah. Huh? Well, that should have happened before they woke up. So I guess there are still memories yet again. Hey, answer my question. If you guys are the Mono Cubs, then. Hey! Who the hell are you, punks? Huh? Huh? That is. What do you mean? What? We're just wondering. Money. Do you guys have ultimate talents or anything like that? Ultimate talents? No. I don't have one. That we know of, at least. I have a skill that I devote myself to, but I wouldn't call it an ultimate talent. Uh, um... Me, either. I don't have anything like that. Okay. Yeah, same here. Told you so! I knew it! They haven't gotten their first memory yet. Hey! Mono Fanny, weren't you in charge of that? Oh, Mono Fanny. Oh, I didn't realize she had like a bra on too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, she's sleeping? Yeah, they like they've taken traits from the characters of the other games. Like that Gundam scarf. Oh, you're right. I didn't. I just saw the scarf, and I I wasn't even thinking about it in the terms of Gundam. Yeah, that's really weird. Why did Nabikus in other games? Unless maybe it's from like the game we didn't play. I don't know. You stupid. Oh, I didn't read the line, but I, I guess you guys had plenty of time to read that. She's obviously faking it. Okay, Chihiro Fanny. 
not Chihiro. I keep on saying the word Chiaki. <laughs> Even if she's faking, she looks so peaceful. Let's whisper so we don't wake her up. Hmm. If you say so. Um. Anyway, if you guys really are the Mono Cubs, then. Who cares? <laughs> don't worry about us. The real issue is use bastards. Use. Did Fuyuhiko say use? I don't remember him saying use, but I mean he did say bastards a lot, and yeah, I know he said that. Use guys. Well, issue is putting it mildly. This is actually a huge problem. Use all have forgotten your talents and become generic high school students. Oh, the horror! <laughs> huh? Forgotten? So. See, according to the backstory, there's this ultimate hunt going on. Ultimate hunt. That's something new. You've all lost your memories. I've become different people because of the ultimate hunt. Uh, um, what are you talking about? Oh, well. Right now. Well, in your current state, it's pretty much pointless to talk to you guys about it. It's just you. I, it's just you, but I used use just because I'm used to it. <laughs> the first thing we need you guys to do is remember your true selves. That's right. Yeah, you need to reclaim your sealed talents by regaining your memories. What? What the? Are you awake already? Why? I don't get it. What are these sealed talents you're talking about? Oh. How are we supposed to talk when you keep asking so many friggin' questions? Yeah, we're not some swift-footed singer who's landing another future ex-boyfriend. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Swift-footed, <laughs> huh? Oh well. Let's do this already. No one wants to watch a bunch of generic high school whiners. That's right. First, we'll update your wardrobe so you guys look all cute and spiffy. Yeah, we have to match, or right, let's or see what not happens. have uniforms at all. Let's suddenly close. Are they just gonna like fall on us? <laughs> What's with the air horn? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's like Sailor Moon. <laughs> Oh man, this game is so crazy already. Fabulous! Oh, we get a backpack. Even more fabulous. Even more fabulous. I guess we're a musical girl. Well, now we are. Oh my god, Whoa. the tiny one, did you see him? No, I didn't see him. Uh-huh. The music's back. What am I wearing? Hmm, looking good. Now you look more like Ultimates. Why is the guy like a... He looks like Raiden now. Oh my god, he does. <laughs> Ultimates? Really? So... Next up, the memory you've all been waiting for. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Get ready! Once the seal is broken, we'll be in the domain of the killing game! Killing game? Oh yeah, it's back. Alright! Now then. After the flashback light helps you remember your amazing talents, this amazing story will begin for real this time. So long, farewell. So long and farewell. It's like the opposite of the Men in Black flashy light. Yeah. Oh, Whoa. Oh. Chatty. Family. Classic. Finals. Piano. Friends. Oh well, yeah, we're definitely into music, I guess. And we got our first save point. Nice. Did I say no by accident? No, here we go. <laughs> Switch date display. Interesting. I guess if you want it displayed like date month or month date. I guess so. Well, I guess we'll save here. I guess it'll also be the first stopping point for this episode. Sounds like a good idea. However, it'll be like the first two games where if I save it, it'll automatically begin the next part. So I'm just going to leave it off here. This is going really well so far. I like this. I like the new environment and... I wasn't really sure as soon as I saw those like five Monokuma, I was like, oh no, this might be a bit too much, but I kind of like them. Mm -hmm. Like I got used to their personalities really quickly. But I miss Monokuma. I guess that's why it was so hard to find him in Japan. I guess so. That would make sense. I did not see any little them though. Yeah. But um, yeah, the, the one guy in red is kind of like Monokuma. It's kind of mm -hmm. like the original, mm -hmm. but I guess we'll see where it goes. This is, this is going to be crazy. And I guess once we get to the next part of the game, we'll see more about each character and what they're like. Which will be kind of cool. Mm -hmm. So until then, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I'm looking forward to seeing more. Till then, take care.